Here's a quick travel tip. As soon as we arrive in Melbourne and I'm waiting for my luggage, I jump online and I purchase my Skybus tickets on skybus.com.au. You can save a few dollars that way. Welcome to Melbourne. So we're really looking forward to spending time around Melbourne and sharing it with you. We hope you enjoy. You can purchase a Mikey card from any train station or 7-Eleven convenience store. And the Mikey card can be used on trams, trains and buses. A fun thing to do is to catch a tram, it takes about 15 minutes, down to St Kilda where you can see Luna Park, St Kilda Beach and also the famous cake shops in Ackland Street. We wandered around Chinatown and found this hot pot restaurant. After choosing our ingredients, the chef took them away and cooked up a delicious hot pot for us to share. was so delicious that hot pot and you know that's the great thing about Melbourne you can just wander around and find these fantastic little places to eat and that was just amazing and the guy was so friendly and it, did you see at the end he gave us a dessert I thought that was so nice anyway completely delicious $18 in total for both of us bargain so we've just checked into the hotel that we're staying at and it's a self-contained apartment and it's called Imagine by Marco. We're paying around about 900 or a bit less than $900 for a seven night stay here. Come and have a look. It's actually a busy time in Melbourne now because they have the Australian Open Tennis happening soon. So a lot of hotels are booked out. It was an expensive time. So this is a pretty good deal. There's our bathroom. And here's our bedroom. Here's our self-contained kitchen. It's got a lounge area, TV, dining area, big fridge, and has another bedroom. At this dumpling restaurant, we place our order from our table.
this beautiful? We're at Southgate on the Yarra River here in Melbourne. And you can see it's such a beautiful dining precinct. There's three stories of restaurants across the river there. It's just beautiful. And behind us is the iconic Flinders Street Station clock tower. And it's just gone 10 o'clock and it's Friday night. And it's a very balmy night. There's a lot of people walking around and dining outside. We just had a delicious dinner with my brother at the Chinese restaurant in Chinatown. And then we had dessert in one of the cafes here called Blue Train. And Blue Train has been here at Southgate for about, mm, about around about 30 years, I think. So we had uh, we had coffee and dessert there, which was which was really good. It was great to catch up with him. And we're just having a little walk around Southgate now on the way back to our accommodation, which is lovely. Join us next week to see more of Melbourne in part two.